The simplest and most natural form of the equation of a line to write down is what's called the point-slope form. Now this is going to look very weird, and in fact it's not a very convenient form of the equation to do algebra to. But it's incredibly natural to write down from a graph or from a story. I'm going to start with a graph here. Suppose I gave you this line and said, this line is the graph of an equation. What equation is it? Well, there are lots of different ways that you could figure out what equation it is. But the easiest way is to use what's called the point-slope form. Here's how we use this. First, we ask, what is the slope of this line? In order to do that, we need to find two kind of nice points on the line. And looking through, I see this point and this point being places where the line cr cuts across grid lines. So I have the point x is negative 1, y is 0. I have the point x is 2, y is negative 4. I could just count it out. Right. I go right 3, down 4, and just in that way I get the slope is negative 4 thirds. Or I could use the slope formula. So negative 4 minus 0 over 2 minus negative 1. Again, negative 4 thirds. Either way, my slope is negative 4 thirds. But that's not enough to make a whole equation, right? It turns out this is actually pretty cool. The slope is the same no matter which point on the line I pick. So I'm going to say, okay, my points now are 2, negative 4, and x, y, some other point on the line. I need to figure out what the relationship is between x and y. Then my slope is y minus negative 4 over x minus 2. I'm going to take this equation and multiply it by x minus 2 on both sides and I get y minus negative 4 equals the slope times x minus 2. In other words, y plus 4 equals, I already know the slope, negative 4 thirds times x minus 2. Check this out. This is the equation of my line. What does that mean? That means if I take a different point, say this point, at this point looks like it's x equals 1 half, y equals negative 2. If I plug in x equals 1 half, y equals negative 2, that is the extra point on my line, I should get a solution of this equation. Let's see if that happens. Negative 2 plus 4, that's 2. Negative 4 thirds, times 1 half minus 2. That's negative 4 thirds times one half minus 2. Convert it to a fraction. That's negative 3 halves. 
and then negative 4 thirds times negative 3 halves is 2. We got the same answer on both sides. It really is a solution. In general, given a slope and a point, the equation of the line with that slope through that point is given by y minus the given y equals the slope times x minus the given x. And this is actually an incredibly easy and useful way to write down the equation of a line. 